exactly. Um, we've obviously got a good academy set up over there, but that doesn't detect away from... The Goes upfield and he finds Wheatley. Manchester United on the front foot here. Real opportunity. Shot comes in. Good save. Well, they're winning that ball and now the support's coming up with them. When he cuts inside, you think he's got half a chance there. And maybe two. Williams, lovely infield run, and he slipped this through. Chance, real opportunity now for Manchester United. Turn towards goal. Just a couple of moments ago, slid through to Ethan Wheatley. Does brilliantly well to win that, and then the opportunity for... Stop, Alan, stop! Of down the right-hand side to Muir. Muir gets the cross in. Eli Harrison was flapping, drilled home. Well... Eli Harrison gets there, tries to make contact, it falls all the way out to the far side and Nico O'Reilly opens the scoring. From the right-hand side from Muir, just tempts Harrison out, might have just got a touch on it, but drilled in there from a quite an acute angle really, from O'Reilly and his left foot hits it on a half volley. Good finish, isn't it? Can't argue with that. Well, he does get a fingertip on it. And then Nolan was... City Football Academy. So if United aren't going to win this one, an easy pass to Sam Murray, who had charged away down the left-hand side. And into midfield is loose. That's a Oh, what a goal. What an incredible finish that is. Spots Eli Harrison off his line. And Nico O'Reilly gets his second of the game, and it is some finish from the Manchester City. Some off, 40 yards out, left footed, can't argue with that. Great finish. That's two exceptional finishes from Nico O'Reilly. The... That is very, very good from the Manchester City. All head taller than anybody else in the penalty area. Here comes the ball. Close to the keeper, that is finished, and it's finished by Louis Jackson. Gets a brilliant nodded head on the ball. And Louis Jackson from close range gets Manchester United back into it. 2-1, 10 minutes. To he defended, uh, which I've not been used to doing. Right at the back post, adjusts his feet well. Free header for him there and got it on target. That's the main thing. That could give everybody, or should give everybody, an injection of confidence. And it could... He pats him on the side and says, come on then. Still got 10 minutes. Well, maybe it's a moment from a tight angle. Uh, and then back. Uh, that, that is the least surprising thing I've seen in this half. Definitely needed to retreat that wall ever so slightly. It's the right thing to do when you're in a wall. Be close, too close to the ball and get walked back. Oh, that is fantastic. It's absolutely brilliant. Great free kick from the left foot of Seb Naylor. The left back bends one over the wall and into the side netting. And you can't argue with any of them off. Yeah, left footed strike, uh, like you said, was sort of over a wide of the wall there on that far side when Harrison's covering the other side. The side. Some days everything goes your way. Well, Manchester, 10 minutes looking to try and find an equaliser, but sometimes the luck doesn't fall your way. Full time whistle goes. <coughs> Nico O'Reilly with his two first half goals giving City a 2-0 lead at the break. It was Louis Jackson though that managed to nod Manchester City back in it. Lovely corner, appeared from nowhere and nodded it home. But to finish things off, right at the end of the game, Seb Naylor's excellent left-footed free kick goes past Eli Harrison and it means that Manchester City take all three points in this under-18s Premier League North game full-time at Carrington. Manchester United 1, Manchester City 3.